came here around so fast, seeing that you came up a um, championship two years ago, we had some hard work to do. Yes, I didn't expect to run a PB, but give thanks for it. With I'm your surprised. teammates that in the race, did that give you extra motivation to go out there and run faster? Yes, I just went out there and did it for both of us. How, how, how does it feel to be the sprint double champion? <laughs> it's overwhelming. I can't find words to explain how I feel. What was your race plan going in? Well, my coach told me come off the corner very, very hard and just come home on the home stretch. Coming into the home stretch, of course, you were under a little bit of pressure because you have um, another girl outside um, that was, you know, running very well. What, what was going through your mind at the time? My aim was to just come off the corner first and maintain until the finish. Now, last night when I spoke to you, you had two gold medals, now you have three gold medals. Does this mean anything? How does it make you feel? Does it make you feel any different? I feel great. I didn't really, I wasn't thinking about three gold medals, but I'm grateful for it. Not that, I did not know what the other girls' standards were. I came out here and did my best. And of course, I said next year, which will be under 18, you'll be back in the under 18 section next year. Any, any plans? plan is to train very hard, see how successful it will be. And again, send a message back home to the Jamaican people. Well, big up to all my motivators, my coach Mr. Goburn, my mother Cassandra Scott, my best friends that always motivate me, everybody, Jamaica number one.